What is up guys? Hope everyone's doing well and welcome back to another episode. I just clocked out of work and we are gonna ride today. So I think uh, I'm gonna hit up a local uh, OG local spot. Uh, it's like a little crusty, super crusty bank spot. We call the pit. I think the homie Chase is gonna meet up with me. I think today's goal is to do like some brake tricks, maybe some foofs, maybe like an abubica. I think that's what it's called. I don't even know. I'm so new, new to like the brake thing. I got a really nice brake lever and uh, I think I just dug out some calipers from my tool shed and uh, I think they're rant calipers. So everything's dialed up. Um, I have a whole new bike. I'm not gonna really talk about it today, but you'll see some clips of it. And um, yeah, let's go hit up the spot. Just like that, we are here. So while we're waiting for Chase and waiting for my GoPro to charge a little bit more, I would like to announce that I will be now repping Carson Cyclery. Who the fuck is calling me? A home improvement company just called me. I don't even own one, bro. I hate telemarketers, dude. You try to do something cool and productive and then they just ruin everything. But yeah, anyways, I will be repping Carson Cyclery. I've been going there for a little while now, and uh, the workers slash owners are the best people in town. They're super nice. They have a great selection of typically any bike you would want. Beach cruiser, road bike, mountain bike, and BMX bikes. They have BMX parts on hand, and if you would like anything specific, they can special order you anything, pretty much. If you want a Sunday or a fit, or a kink, you got it at their door. The best part of ordering from a actual BMX shop is that when they get it in, well, not every shop, but they, Carson Cyclery, will gladly build the bike for you so you don't have to do anything at no extra charge. I really don't get why uh, BMX stores or just bike shops in general won't even offer to build the bike you just bought off them for you for free like what are you doing on top of that a lot of shops don't even give you free maintenance after you buy the bike what makes you think that customer is gonna come back tell a friend about you guys you need to do that for your customers no one's gonna come back to your shop if you're not willing to offer them service or some kind of guarantee. They are passionate about the bike community just as much as you. And that's why I love going there. Ever since I got back into BMX, you know, got my muscles moving again, I got into watching more videos, watching YouTubers bike, watching podcasts. I got so like back into BMX that I wanted to do more. So that's why I got into YouTube. No matter how good I am, I just wanted to like record my process and just record BMX content as much as I can. And in that process, I found Carson Cyclery. I have reached out to so many local shops, even even childhood shops that we used to, me and my friends used to spend all our money at. And I would talk to them. I, I literally approached them and being 31 years old now and them knowing me as when I was a little kid. And they kind of just, thought I was just being ridiculous and literally wanted nothing to do with advertising their shop or growing the sport of BMX which kind of saddened me but totally opened up my eyes honestly so now I'm working with Carson Cyclery it's the best shop in the South Bay to literally to buy any bike I swear like I'm I'm not just saying this because I think they're like the nicest people they're just super deserving and I really don't think there's anybody in my area which is the south bay that deserves more attention they have a super nice shop and one of the best mechanics in the south bay honestly he can fix literally anything on any bike well maybe not anything but like 99 percent of your problems he's got you so by repping them i got you guys 10 percent off anything and everything you buy in Carson Cycle Restore. That means if you buy a $500 bike, if you buy a $600 bike, you get 10% off that. You know what that means? No tax. 
you go there and you bring cash and whatever you see on that price tag that's what you're paying and nothing more go hit up cars and cyclery i think they're closed monday so don't go there on a monday please but yeah go hit them up mention my name rob alexander and you get 10 percent off your order with that being said chase is still not here i'm gonna go outside and stretch and just feel my chi before I eat shit on this bank. So since this spot's like really rough and there's cracks everywhere and holes everywhere and rocks everywhere, I am gonna try to, I'm gonna use my gloves. And I haven't used gloves in years. I think I hate gloves when I'm riding because I just love the feel of my grips. But I'm gonna try out some gloves today. So who, who out there rides with gloves and loves gloves? Comment below. Fly it. Hey, look at my cheap drone. Fly it. No, it's gonna fucking go somewhere in the cars. Ah! Just do a fakey real quick? Oh. I'll show you a fucking fakey. Oh, the cab? Take it off, dude. I did. The sweater's way too restrictive, I dude. Did. You're losing all your tricks, bro. I did. Put that shit away. Oh! Shit. Woo! Oh! Dude, I need to go like straight in. Oh my god, that was good. Alright, that one's scary. <laughs> oh, oh, scary. Whoa. Oh, shit. <laughs> Honestly, the gloves, they're not that bad. They do feel, they did feel a little funky at first, but I think I'm getting used to them. Fuck you. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Oh my God. Oh my God, I didn't hop. Dude, and there's like... Fuck! Alright. Don't hit the brakes on the way down. Dude. <laughs> What'd you say? What? Eat your asphalt out of your ass. <laughs> Alright, I think that's gonna do it for the day. The journey of learning abubakas and fufunus is gonna be a fun one. What do you gotta say? I don't know. Say bye. I just want to go home. <laughs> and if you're in the South Bay area, don't forget to check out Carson Cyclery and just check out the store. You don't have to buy anything. But if you do, you get 10% off. Just mention Rob Alexander and you're all good. Till next time, see you guys later. Bye.